If you're not monitoring your microphone, here's where you should. To monitor your microphone, you'll want a wired headset plugged into the audio interface or directly into the mic. You'll then be able to hear your voice in your headphones in real time as you speak into the mic. If you're someone that has to go back to watch your VODs to hear how you sounded after the fact, you could definitely benefit from monitoring. By monitoring, you're going to be hearing exactly what your viewers are hearing in real time so you can troubleshoot and make any adjustments on the fly. If you're a new streamer and you don't have a ton of viewers around to tell you that you're muted, it could go unnoticed for a long period of time. But by monitoring your mic, you can completely prevent this from happening. Monitoring your mic can also help you learn microphone etiquette, which is especially relevant if you're using a dynamic mic because you do need to be in much closer proximity. Monitoring will help you get to know the best proximity for your microphone and your voice so your viewers can hear you loud and clear. If you're using an Elgato Wave DX with the Wave XLR or any other audio interface, you can plug your headphones directly into the 3.5 millimeter port. Similarly, if you're using the Wave 3 microphone, you can plug your headphones directly into the back. This will allow you to monitor in real time through Wavelink. You can also adjust the volume of your monitoring via Wavelink without impacting your stream mix. Pair any Elgato Wave mic with the open back Corsair Virtuoso Pros and you'll be an audio pro in no time.